uh, hello and welcome uh, I'm Sahak from uh, Sagraph Academy and today I'm going to show you how to create this uh, 3d cube in Adobe After Effects CS6 uh, as you uh, are looking at this cube so you will uh, recreate the same, uh, the same uh, 3d cube in Adobe After Effects CS6 so let's start uh, now uh, we are in Adobe After Effects CS6 so first of all we will create a new uh, composition uh, the composition height in weight I will take 500 by 500 pixel and the uh, frame rate is 25 and I will take uh, the duration for uh, 30 minutes and ok so now we have this composition you will right click here and you will just uh, create a new solid uh, any color doesn't matter uh, so now we will go to effect uh, we will select our uh, layer we will go to effect generate and from here we will apply the ramp uh, so the ramp we will take uh, radial radial uh, ramp and we will just change the color to something uh, whatever color you would like I would like to set it uh, like uh, orange and the second color also you will take it like uh, darker orange something like this I am uh, happy with that color so uh, now we will just uh, create the border for this uh, we will take another uh, solid ok and just here this uh, rectangle tool we will double click uh, to create a mask so now this is the mask and uh, we will double click the mask and we will just uh, by holding alt we will just increase the size and from here we will invert it so now we have a cool uh, border for that uh, for the border also we can apply effect and uh, ramp uh, generate ramp you will make the ramp uh, uh, radial you will bring this color here somewhere this color here we just want this corner to be a little bit uh, black just like this uh, so as this is a basic tutorial we don't want to go uh, too much deep so this uh, uh, one side is ready uh, we will just create another composition with the same height and uh, width and you will grab uh, this uh, side and you will just drop it to here just I will rename this one for uh, main 3d cube and from uh, for this one uh, this we don't need anymore so this one we will just uh, duplicate it uh, here not here because later on we cannot change anything here so we will duplicate everything here uh, so we will make it uh, so I made it uh, six copies so I will I will just uh, drag and drop here in the composition and I will arrange it by number Excuse me, uh, just uh, I arrange this uh, in my composition here and uh, by here uh, we will make all these uh, 3D by just pushing this 3D button now everything is 3D and uh, we will press A in uh, the anchor point 
here for the z position we will uh, we will apply the same value we have here so 250 what it will do it will uh, push the um, anchor point at 250 pixel to the back to the z, uh, z axis and then now here in the active camera we will go to custom view 1 so here we can see in the 3d space just we will close everything uh, so now you will click R for rotation uh, we will leave the first one here so we will just close the first one and the second one uh, here in the Y rotation we will write 90 degrees so it will re uh, rotate our uh, one side 90 degrees uh, to the Y and we will close this one also we will go to uh, y rotation for the second for the third one and we will this time we will write 180 degrees so it will rotate this uh, 180 degrees to the y axis now this side is completed also and uh, we will go to the fourth one also the same we will write 270 so every time we want to uh, rotate 90 degrees uh, so now this cube is uh, fourth side is done for the bottom and the top uh, we will mm, touch the X rotation uh, this X rotation I will uh, put the 90 degrees so it at the bottom and minus 90 degrees for the top uh, we will mention nine, minus 90 degree so now our cube is ready uh, what we will do we will select everything and here we will uh, toggle switch mode or we will press F4 so now here is the mode we will uh, uh, click on the uh, this mode and we will add alpha so now the cube is ready but we cannot uh, rotate it because uh, uh, first of all we will take uh, this uh, null object and we will pair everything to the null object for the control so now we can control everything from this null object and uh, we will do one thing we will just uh, make the null object also 3d and uh, we will uh, go back to the active camera mode and uh, we will now uh, push the Z position of this null object to cube for the cube now the cube is going back side and the uh, you will press R for rotation for null object and you will rotate to the uh, Y axis and you will just keyframe that one uh, here we will press this uh, letter watch now there is one uh, keyframe and you will just uh, give them three rotation so here will be a smooth rotation you will take a render Uh, so now here is the uh, 3d cube rotating and uh, now one things we can add uh, you will go to this uh, inside composition and we can uh, add the photos logo text whatever you want so first I will go um, uh, to here uh, for here in this uh, first cube I will add some text you will just uh, position it in the right way
I will just copy the same text and paste it here. Uh, now we will create another composition uh, with this uh, 1920 by uh, uh, 1280 by 720 you will just drag this our uh, main cube here so now you see this our cube is ready you put the text and you can put the photo text whatever you want uh, logo so this uh, basic 3d cube is ready uh, now you can uh, put it everywhere you want you can scale it down and you can put it here in somewhere in your composition or here or here so your 3d cube is ready now you can see that our cube is spinning or you can scale it back and here so this was the tutorial hope you enjoy my first tutorial sorry for my weak english and uh, hope you enjoy this tutorial for more tutorials please subscribe to my channel and also you can find me by uh, in the facebook by the link uh, i will put in the description and uh, hope you learn something and hope you enjoy this tutorial uh, okay see you bye bye